get us money every time we finish up there and that keeps us alive most importantly so we don't go bankrupt so that is my goal for her spurt um it appears if i time it around three point uh with her i'll look at my spreadsheet in a second once i get her adjusted to the front here so we're gonna have her go a little bit fast here just to make sure she stays in the front and she's struggling to lead right now she's struggling to lead right now i'm trying to push her up there this must be a fast pace because she is struggling to get up there but it's fine she's in the green i would have preferred for her to be leading it's her first race we could have gotten a better start too um, get her going at around 3.0 it says that's a good time for her yeah I figured that was a fast pace so we'll get her going now like I said there is a slope and maybe on these courses with slope it may be better off for me to actually wait a little bit for their spurts that way they have a little bit more stamina but she's doing well right now Wells time she is doing well right now we're actually in first place we're in first place with Wells time and it looks like we're already gonna get our first win we're gonna get our first win with Wells that's a big win five or six lengths finally just to think that I could have been doing this in the first file that I was playing this game with if I would have done my research. But like I said, I've never played a Gallup Racer or kind of doing extensive research on the courses and the horses and the spurt timing because it's so much different than the other games in the series. I just I never knew that was even going to be a thing here. 6-4 um, me is the favorite. The one. Such a funny name. She's got gate position 9 here for Welsh time. So we got to, uh, as usual, get her out. But she gets out. I think she gets bet out better to the front. Her braking ability... Is her braking ability higher than Glue Factor? I'll have to double check. I think her braking is better. So, oh, gosh. She does. Yeah, she punches right out. She is amazing at her starts. And she gets right to the front without any issues at all. Yeah, well, it's time. She is, she's a solid filly, man. She's a really solid filly. We'll slow her down here just to get her pace back to normal. We'll get her stamina. Preserve her stamina a little bit. Yeah, she's looking good right now. She's looking good right now. We're racing in DC. This course does have a slope. As you can see, we're going down it right now. It's unfortunate. You go down it, the slope on the back straight, and then you have to come up that incline on the front end of the stretch. Slow pace, though, which is good. So this should work out for us. Her stamina is just about halfway through. So we're going to wait a little bit late for her spurt as well. If we can uh, manage to do so. Like I said, we are hugging the rail here. We have nobody else to compete with us. I could try to get out early. I don't know if I want to do that though. Like I said, we'll wait till about 2.7 because we're still maintaining the lead. We are still doing fine. Nobody is catching us yet. We can wait till 2.0. We're gonna go right now. 2.0, we could actually wait. Now she's in the gray. I don't know why she's in the gray, but we are fighting off these fighting off these horses a furlong to go. I don't know who that is coming up on the outside. Let's see if she can finish. Well, it's time looking for another win. We're gonna get it. We're just gonna get it. Wow, we just hung on there. I think I, starting at 2.0, I just I figured nobody was passing us. Nobody was even close. If the field was coming, I would have gotten us a little bit sooner, just to try to keep her ahead. But I'm like, okay, the field is barely coming right now. So I think we timed it right. There's another win. Her first win on the dirt. There for Welsh time. Five lifetime start. She's already got two wins under her belt, two places in one show. She is turning into a fine filly indeed. And I'm glad I bought her. Remember, I was hesitating on buying her in the um in the last episode. And I'm so glad I did. So again, okay odds. We can finish in the money for sure. We just gotta uh we just gotta get our horse there. So let let's see if she can get to the front. Fortunately, we've got post position one. I don't want to be overtaken by anybody else so let's just see if we can get her to the front settle her in relatively quickly fantastic start that's, that's what we need all the time okay she should be okay uh, get up there okay i think she's all right she's in the green right now because she's not in first once we pass this horse she should go to the blue I'm trying to get past this horse sorry she's in the blue all right, that is pretty much what I've been looking for, you know, since we've started this episode. Just getting to the front without too much effort. The last two races with both her and Blue Factor, like I said, I just felt like they weren't going anywhere at all. <laughs> and maybe we were racing against some 
pretty competitive fields with fast pace, but running a fast pace here. But like I said, we had post position one, which helped. Um, so if I want to get her going, get her going now. And I keep forgetting as well, I need to lay off the whip too in this game. Keep forgetting, uh, it's, like I said, it's not like 2004. Don't use the whip because we're good now. We're looking good. Furlong to go. The field is coming. Finish strong, Welsh. Get a win. Get a win. Ah, man. We either we may have gotten second to the eight. I don't know. That was close. I hope we got that win, though. Did we get there? I think we just got there. I think we just got there at the wire. Yep. There's a win. That's what I'm talking about. It's just an adjustment, people. I'm telling you. Some of you guys have never played this game. You wouldn't understand. If you have played this game, you do, like I said, of course, understand this. For the long shot in this race, which means we're expected to finish in dead last. We'll go through the post parade quickly. The one is Sir Brando, ridden my Briggs, or Biggs, excuse me. The two is Bangladesh, ridden my Bella. Three is First Love, ridden my Coffee. Seven is Blues Club, ridden by Dodd. Of course, from our Galibrace 2004 series. Five is Stinky Lou, ridden by Doyle. Six is Jersey Jam, ridden by Alder. Seven is Sleepy Moon, ridden by Benton. The eight is Hurry Dasher, ridden by Colby. We're on the nine, Welsh Time. The ten is Flying Mover, ridden by Ibarra. And the eleven is Big Bad Mom, ridden by Sam's. Alright, let's see what happens here. See if she can get out. It's her last race, anyways. So, decent start. I'm gonna push her to the front and see what happens. So she's running full speed, she's running full speed, she's still running full speed, and she's still not getting to the front. I, I, I swear we didn't have this issue with her. Furlong and a half of her basically running full speed and she still couldn't get to the front. Now she's in the green, I'm going to have to keep her here, this is the best I can do with her. Because we couldn't, we, we tried and we just could not get her to the front. So, it's her last race anyways, let's just see if we can finish better than last place. Still on the green. There we go. Finishing the money would be nice for some funds. But she's battling in the money. She's pushing through somehow. She's in second. She's in first. We Watch. I said she was potentially going to win this race. And, of course, she wins. The long shot. Expected to finish last. In a race where I'm like, this is her last race regardless. She finishes first. She was and she wasn't leading, which is where she needed to be. That uh, this game is so weird sometimes. I swear to you. But I called it. Did I not literally said before the race started? Watch, she wins this race. What happens? She freaking wins. Hey, that's actually good because in this game, when it comes to breeding, your horse's actual racing record as far as wins, losses, all that good stuff, earnings, that actually does make a difference. Rider eval one on two. I didn't even realize you could get over one hundred.